You know, having mental fortitude and then really knowing yourself is important. You can't let anyone break you. Whether it's your mama, your daddy, the environment, school, racism, crime, or the military. You can get things that you need, like discipline and fortitude and tenacity, perseverance from the military. But you can't let the military break you no matter what you saw, no matter what type of combat you've been through, no matter if your friends died. The ability to recover from things like that, and I do know that our men and women go through a lot in battle, especially being in battle for 20 some years that America has waged this war with foreign policy. What you have to do is to be able to always be in control of your feelings, your mind, and all of those things. You can't unsee some things that you've seen, but going into the military, you have to prepare yourself mentally and physically. The physical part, you can get over. The mental part, people are still scarred from it. You see people that are Vietnam vets that are on the street, but you also see Vietnam vets and war vets that are thriving, that are starting companies, that are starting organizations, that are starting movements. What's the difference is the ability to go outside of trauma and to be able to talk yourself. Now, sure enough, there's chemical imbalances and sure enough, there's some things that people have seen that they carry that baggage with them. One of the things that I always start my morning with is the morning jam. That's the journal, that's affirmations, and that's meditation. And those kind of things keep the mind, the body, and the spirit aligned with what you want rather than always looking back in the rear view, take your time to look forward because that's where you need to go, into the future. Don't worry about the past all the time. Just like driving, you want a glimpse at the rear view here and there for perspective. But if you wanna drive forward, you gotta to look to the future through that windshield. Do yourself and everyone around you a favor by spending a little bit of time. It doesn't mean that you are just a soldier, but if you've experienced trauma, loss, if you've experienced sexual abuse or abuse, no matter what it is, you are stronger than your experience.